if you had asked me 11, 12 years ago if I wanted to be a musician, I would not pick that as a career choice. I still wasn't into it. My guest today is arguably one of the most toured artists on the continent. She's a singer, songwriter, actress who's often referred to as Mama Africa. My guest today is Yemi Iberichi Alade. Yemi Alade. At that point in my life, my dad had lost his job. Um, I say lost his job, even though he was a policeman, he was retired yeah. um, prematurely. So when literally. it comes to food and everything that you need, we had rooms full with commodities. I mean, yeah, bags and bags and bags of rice. We had an animal farm. We lacked nothing. And all of a sudden, flat on the floor, nose in the sand. Yeah. Finals came and he told me, well, it would have been you, but you're overconfident. Ah. In 24 hours, <laughs> I moved from no confidence <laughs> to overconfidence. I mean, do you know how big Johnny was? I felt it. But I felt but, it. but I'm sure that you never thought. I never thought. It was a song that leaked now. You did not even release it officially. Uh, it leaked. If you find the picture, there's a picture of me. The profile picture is me with some blonde, blonde way and weave holding one white little pop. What do you mean it leaked? It leaked online. It was never officially released. Yes, it probably would never have been released. God found a way. When we did the song Journey overnight, from, one, from the evening into the night, we felt it was a good song. We parted our ways. By the time we got to Lagos, we got to Lagos, that day, the song leaked. Uh -uh. That day, the song leaked. So, are you saying Johnny did not make the money that you thought it would make? It's one thing to be a musician. It's, some, it's another thing to be a female musician. Right. When my team got the email from her team, it was... My team ignored for a long time because they thought it was a scam email. Yeah. I don't blame them. Because, because a lot I, of scams like we that. We just yeah. sleep, wake up, say Beyonce, they are, ah, yes. ah, ah. And then one day I was in the studio with my manager and he was so <coughs> upset and irritated that some scammers have been emailing him about Beyonce. What kind of... Did, 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 for some reason, normally I would laugh and say, ah, Nigerians know they try. But then, for some the reason, spirits. I said, what's the name of the, of the company that's reaching out to you? And when we responded, it was actually two weeks before they were going to close up the, the project. They had been emailing for months. And um, when we saw all of that and saw everybody, the idea was to come back the next day and record for like, two days i go back to my apartment uh i sleep off wake up the next morning i have no voice no talking voice no singing voice 